Hi, this is Pete Coors. I'm at the 2018 National Western Stock Show here in the yards, having a great time. We always call this the Super Bowl of all the stock shows. This is a huge draw from around the world. It's really a people show. We bring cattle, but it's all about the people. My dad attended here at the stock show for more than 50 years straight, and I've been here every year since 1989. In 65, we come out here on a boxcar with cattle because it was not the interstates weren't out there yet. Well, we've been here for the last 27 years. This is our 60th year. We've come here 75 years. My family has been participating in the stock show more years than I've been alive. This is, of course, the granddaddy of all shows. It's the best of the best. It's a race to see who can find that next great bull they want to buy or the bloodlines they want to use. It's been a family operation since day one. To have the kids down here and show them the yards. We've got some big plans coming down the pike here at the National Western with our redevelopment and redoing the entire complex. Ron Williams is here with us and the new yards will be named after Ron and his wife Seal. It's a great start to our capital campaign. It's going to be bigger, better, and we think it's going to be a benefit to everyone. We are all for that. We're really excited. These yards we're in now have lots of character, lots of memories. But as things change, it's nice to update, have new technology. This land that we stand on and what it represents to the cattle industry is pretty significant. So there's a lot of historic values that come along with it. We're going to preserve as much of the history and legacy as we possibly can because I think it's one of the things that makes the National Western Stock Show what it is. I think the legacy will still stay. We're excited about the changes that are coming. We need a good facility. We're excited to get some new facilities in here and see the stock show continue to evolve and grow. This catwalk that we're standing on here is just history. I remember one of my first years here, I think I was six years old, and all I did was run up and down that catwalk looking at cattle. The catwalk is great, and they can see who's here and then find who they want to go see. In the new yard, I think we got to try very, very hard to get another catwalk into the yard because it's part of the history and heritage here. A lot of people think that the National Western is all about rodeo, but it's uh, certainly not. It's really the stock show itself, what happens out here in the yards that uh, makes this thing work. A lot of education goes on here as well as selling and trading ideas. You get smart people here. You can learn a lot. The yards draw your commercial cattlemen, ranchers. These people do this day in, day out for a living. It's not a hobby. This pays the bills, feeds this nation, feeds the world. If you're in the livestock business and you're serious about this, you will be here. It is a lot of work and it's a a lot of travel and it's a lot of expense but it has really paid off this is just an outstanding place to exhibit cattle and get our cattle in front of a very wide market of people it's a good marketing tool for us the competition has always been something i love but exposure to the industry is our biggest reason why we come i just talked to a gentleman from canada about our cattle and just an opportunity that i wouldn't have if i was at home in iowa right now we get to uh, really expose our program as a smaller breeder to a lot of potential customers that other shows just don't offer for us the platform that the National Western Stock Show does. I love the cattle business because of the values of the cattlemen that are in it. You can shake your hand and make a deal and it's a solid deal. Very thankful to all the relationships we've met and being able to come down and see everybody year to year. The yards down here is the foundation of National Western. This is where it all began. And so it's imperative that we on the board continue on with this legacy. The heritage and the legacy that we've had for 112 years. And make it grow and protect the Western heritage that this is all created.